Hey, the host in Ether Cutler here. Well, today we're going to take a look at Linux Zorn OS. And this is the, this is Zorn OS 12. Let's see what we got here. We got a count of um, time with the calendar. Um, here's the notifications. Um, this actually looks like a just modified version of GNOME. Um, but yeah, what well, we got in the taskbar is files. Um, Geary, which is just a email client, and Chromium web browser. So that's cool. This comes Chromium, set up by five to lock. This was come with by five instead of Chromium. Glad to see it with Chromium. Um, under the accessories, we've got an activity journal, a calculator, clock, documents, files, maps, photos, text editor, and weather. Um, under games, you get solitaire, majong, mines, um, sudoku. Um, in the graphics, you get GIMP, leave off his draw, simple scan. Um, on the internet, you get Chromium or Bob and Empathy for your, um, for your semester genius, Geary. I'll come back to this, and I'll show you what that is. Office, you get the full leave office suite with contacts in the calendar. Under sound videos, you get Zero, which is a um, CD bird. In my opinion, I choose K3D, but that's cool. Um, cheese, Why Campbell, Rhythm Box, and Totem. I think this is Totem, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, total move play, so get totem. Um under system tools, you know you get your basics, your additional drivers, but those pipe your timers, um backups, a shortcut to discs to see if any you know a disc is so we kinda like cheap I did, but a little bit different. Input method, online account, setting, software manager, software and update, software updater, startup application, set up disk creator. Now what this is, is this is actually cool. What it does is basically let you make any um, Ubuntu based um, distro um, and makes it bootable. So that's really cool. Um, Windows wireless drivers, so you click on this, um, like for example, I'll let you use Windows drivers, I'll show you a quick punch in one, two, three, password. See, and it'll let you install and remove drivers, can begin to work, you know, all the goodies. Um, because the, the wireless doesn't work on this computer out of the box, but again, this is a virtual machine, so... No one, I don't really know. Um, utilities, um, I don't know about that. Then you get wine, you know, you play on Linux, you know, stuff like that. Um, uh, now, let me get back to this. Um, this is really cool utility. Um, what it does is that it lets you switch web browser on the fly. Um, so like, for example, we can remove Chromium, and put in the password. And then, then you can like install another 
Uh, so this is empathy to heaven. This is Stalin. So. Okay, so now it's uh, let's see, and then if we go in there, and then instead of them um, coming, you get the empathy. That's point to you. So that's a book about uh, that thing. So we can just, um, you yeah, know, like, stick. Oh, and I like that feature where you can change the change in and about the on the fly. Um, I think that's really cool. Um, and then the software center, um, Um, this is just, just the gnome software center, I think. Um, um, you know, when you set in, you know, the basic, basics, um, background notifications, online accounts, uh, privacy, religion, the settings, um, search, I mean, religion, language, privacy, search, Zone appearance, Bluetooth, favorite got Bluetooth adapted. Um, details, you know, just tells you about the, about it. Uh, so yeah. Um, anyway, that's sort of the less. Um, what do I gotta say about Zone OS? It's a great distro for people to go to that wants an alternative from Windows and that. It's made to pretty much be best of both worlds. Um, I don't think I can. So you can. Um, I I know in the previous one. See. Yeah. Okay. You did. Um, you can change a lot of stuff about it. Um. Get the gnome. So pretty much it's you get the gnome one. Um you also get this layout right here. Um it's pretty much the same in my opinion. Um you can change you can change a lot of stuff with the mechanics. Um and if you can ultimate can at least make, can make it look like a man. So, yeah. Um, I really like the new OS. I suggest it for people that are new to Linux and we use Linux in their life. Because the new OS is a great distro to teach out for you guys. But, yeah. Um, again, it's Stevie G. The Effective, and I will talk to you guys in my next book. Y'all take care, and you should have a nice day.